very tall. You are, you're just you're the tallest one here, so you're <laughs> on the highest chair. <gasps> Um, so yeah, we got a few things. If you, I'm not asking you to send us anything, but people have asked still. Um, and we didn't actually have a PO box for a while. Yeah, for several months. Um, because I moved and the, the one that was biased was no longer close. We've had one for a few months now, uh, but I don't think anybody knows. It's been in the description of the video, but I'll pin it in the comment below, the top comment, if you'd like to send us anything. Once again, not asking you to, to send us anything. But uh, we've had some of these for quite some time. Hopefully there's yeah. nothing perishable in we it. Were, we were waiting to open up at least three or four at the same time together, and it's been a while. So if one of these is yours and it's been a while, that's why. Okay, so we got either this is hate mail, <laughs> which we've had, believe it or not. Okay, no need to read on video. Okay, so there you go. There you go. Thank you so much. <laughs> we'll read that on video. We read did it get video. Who's, it was, um, what was his name? Uh, Victor G, right? Oh, yeah. He's the one that sent us sent the us hate uh, mail in the mail. Hate mail, which was fantastic. This is from Sandy Netburn. Mm. Do you know her? Yes. That's my. That's Sandy, the ventriloquist girl who I've talked with, who's living on Long Island. Uh, you've, you've seen her on Instagram. Sandy. Teenage girl living on Long Island. She's a ventriloquist. She has puppets. She's a big Partridge Family fan. Big 1970s TV show fan. Well, she sent us anthrax, so thanks. <laughs> Excellent! Oh, I can tell what that is. Is there anything on the other side? There's two things. Or is that just a... Oh. Who's that? Who's that? <laughs> That's you in the Partridge Family. That is actually taken from a Partridge Family still headshot, yes. Thank you so much. Dear Ricky and Corbin, I really hope you both enjoy uh, the pictures I painted for you both. Ricky, I couldn't help but to draw you as a kid. You were TV's uh, something, little Ricky. I'm so glad you introduced me to OSR. I've made so many new friends because I'm a fan of you both. Really love getting to watch all of your videos. You're both so funny and you never fail to make me smile. Then uh, thank you both for just being yourselves. You're both great. And I look forward to watching many more videos, many more videos. I'm a relatively new stupid baby, which is not something I thought I'd ever say. Love, <laughs> Sandy Newburn and friends. P.S. Corbin, there's this TV show I love. It's called The Partridge Family. <laughs> Watch season four, episode one of it. You won't regret it. What's that one? That's the one of my debut. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen it. Thank you, Sandy. <laughs> thank and you I so will, much. I will see you when I come to Long Island. That's awesome. Uh, this one... I don't know who it's from, so I won't say. Rick, watch out, I'm gonna stab you. Oh my God, y'all are so dramatic. Okay, I'm opening it like an ape. <laughs> I'm, glad, I'm glad you admit to it. Oh, we got, we got more DVDs. Yeah. Kama Sutra ladies, bring it on. The girls of Kama Sutra part nine. There, oh. Let's see. Uh, oh, I recognize one of them. Dear Rick and Corbin, as someone who is in a never-ending quest to see and, if possible, own every movie that VJ Raz has ever participated in, I offer you three of his best. Oh, yeah! Awesome. First, Didi Ishkia with Maduri Dixit and the Sheridan Shaw. This movie has one of VJ's outstanding villainous turns, and yet he's oddly sympathetic in it. It is a sequel to the movie Ishkia, which I haven't seen because no VJ, no point. <laughs> Second... <laughs> Raghu Romeo, VJ Ra's romantic hero. He is the leading man in one of the strangest romantic comedies in Bollywood history, yeah. and he almost dances. Third, Kia Dili Kia Lahore. Thank you. BJ's directorial debut. A simple story with only four characters. It's set in the years immediately following partition. Word is he had a bit of trouble with one of the leads, the actor VJ Raz. <laughs> One movie that I haven't found on DVD is 2016's Mission Tiger. According to Wikipedia, Mission Tiger is the first film featuring the root cause of tiger poaching in India and intends to impart a message, save the tiger. VJ did the movie for free, saying, quote, One of the reasons for doing Mission Tiger was to promote the message of saving tigers. I feel that not just tigers, every single animal should be saved. I feel that if man feels he's gotten brains and that he has evolved, then why do so many animal killings take place? In this film, at least yeah. the tiger is talked about, so I did the film and I didn't charge anything from the producers. I did this for free of cost. 
It's not a very good movie. The hero's pretty much a putz. But, <laughs> as always, I love the term putz. Thank you. BJ's remarkable and remarkably athletic. Who knew that this amazing actor was an animal welfare activist? Mission Tiger can be found on YouTube for cost of sure. Enjoy. Patricia Mary, President, Secretary, Treasurer, and sole member of, and well, New York's VJ Roz fan club. <laughs> That's awesome. Thank, Thank you. you, Patricia. Yeah, well, I know of one of them. Ishka, Ishka, I think it's called. And forgive us for all of the times we've missed VJ Roz in videos. You know, we are VJ lot. fans. We really are. Um, and this last one. America in Texas, to be specific. Plano. Plano, Texas. <laughs> Stupid. He's putting it at me. There you go. Okay. Open it like an egg. Okay. I, I literally have never cut somebody with a knife. My word. Yet. Oh, you need in there? Whoa. Whoa. What's going on in here? Onion. Say that? Fryums? Fryums. Onion fryums. Onion fryums. Finger bottom. What in the world? Say that. Reptile appam. Reptile appam. Holy moly. There's no note. Maybe there's a note in there. Why do you have a knife? I never, I never cut anybody. It's like a redneck's famous last words. Hey, y'all, watch this. <laughs> Cool. I'll show it to you, bud. That's gorgeous. Look at that. That's really pretty. I like to think it's Ravi Shankar. Okay. <laughs> Hold that. <laughs> it's got some weight on it. Wow. That's heavy. Oh, it's pure gold. It may it's very pure. well be. Oh. Dude. Dude, and there's a, uh, a guy, I don't know what the instrument's called. It's one we love. Here, hold it. There, feel the weight on this thing. Oh, wow. Right? For the way it looks. It's really heavy. Uh... Whoa. That's what Evie would Here say. Here we go. Uh, one playing tabla. Nice. So we got. This is gorgeous. Usaji. Ravi Shankar. Usaji. Ravi Shankar. I don't know if he's yeah. Usaji. Is he in Usaji? Is there a different I, I think he would be. No, I think that applies to him. Just I think it's for anybody who's a, who's considered a, a, a teacher that's in great respect. <laughs> no. These are gorgeous. These are so pretty. Oh. Yeah. Here's the third one. Look. You see that one? Look. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I agree, Lily. Thank you so much. Wow. I really wish I knew what this stuff was. Like, well, you guys probably know. In the comments, educate us, teach us what we need to know. It says it has decor items and some eatables. eatables. You, you can, can deep fry them. and eat. Okay. It's similar to veggie fries. Oh, I think like the thing that they sent. So it's maybe? a quick, it's a quick deep fry. So yeah, you can put it in really hot stuff, drop it in, take it out. So it. yeah, send us like a recipe that we can like. Yeah. Or do we just deep fry? Them? I don't have an air fryer. Do you have an air fryer? No. I wonder if you could just air fry them. No. These look like noodles. They need to be put in the oil. Yeah. What are the the pasta called that looks like that? It looks like a little penne that's been chopped yeah. up. Penne pasta, right? That's what it looks like. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. That's so awesome. Gorgeous. Um, so I hope you, I don't know how long this video might be very long. Once again, if you'd like to send us anything, I will pin our PO box in the description, in the description and in the top comment, if you'd like it. And if for some reason you're wondering if it's arrived, you can always ask uh, by contacting us and we'll confirm it's arrived, but it may be a while because we wait until we've got a few things together to open them all at please, the same time. Please tell us if it's like perishable. Yes, <laughs> please do. Yeah. Because it could be months. Yes. <laughs> and then your friends <laughs> yeah. fail. Yeah. Anyways, sure. thank you guys so much. Um, how was it? It was good. He wouldn't want to watch the VJ Ross DVD. Yeah, I agree. I get it. Time for a movie. Just. <laughs>